Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Fallout 4. We are going to be heading into Diamond City today. So let's get let's get going. Need to sell some stuff and then we'll head back. Wait, wait, wait. I did follow the signs. Hold on. What the? It's, oh, it's still around. Okay, never mind. I was like, I thought this was like exiting out, but no, it's... Open the gate. Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out. Is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <gasps> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> open up. You. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. What, what's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Well, in all honesty, I do have enough supplies to stock the store for a month. Sounds good. Let's go. Another great day in Diamond City. But between me and dog meat, we've got enough supplies to supply Piper, supply this forever. You back inside. I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for part. Is that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. What newspaper are you talking about? Mine. Public occurrences. And we're the hard look at the truth. So are you with us or not? Um, well, she got me in here, so probably should, should help. I believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, miss. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? What are you two arguing about, anyway? What do you think? Print lies and everybody's happy, but if you print the truth... <laughs> <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? You had to sell all my garbage. I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? Um... Who would I talk to about... Finding a missing person. Well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. Oh, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. A mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, uh, there is uh, one private citizen, Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down, usually for debts or whatnot. No, I have to get going. I'm sorry Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. <sighs> this is ridiculous. 
I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security always shrivels away when talk of missing persons comes I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> I'm impressed. Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? I think I just found my next story. All right, so we can finally head into hey. Diamond City. You're that traitor Piper was talking about. Yes, I am the traitor, but I actually I am well stocked. It is kind of funny that that's actually not a lie. I have enough stuff to stock a place for a while. Maybe not a full month, but I can stock it for a while. Okay, so I'll probably pick Piper up as a follower. I don't know who I'm going to use her dog meat. I might use Paladin Dance later on. I didn't use him in my, my original playthrough, but he is so OP. He's by far the most useful follower just because of the equipment that he had. Okay, I need to wait also. It'd be really nice to be able to steal this Nuka Cola Quantum. There's a way you can. I have it on my main save. I forget how you get it. Alright, let's go ahead and wait until the day. Let's see. I think 9 hours. I think the shops open up at 8. In some games, the shops open up at different times. And I always, like in The Witcher. Your safest bet is to wait until, like, 10. Um, some of them open up earlier than that, but 10 is kind of the safe time. I think it's 8 here. Okay, what is the heck is happening? Hey, kiddo. How do paper sales? Well, the prices are getting overloaded. Why is the audio so low here? And there's no subtitles. Actually, I know why the audio is so low. It's because I'm way over here. That's just annoying. Why didn't that happen? Okay, let's go talk to Arturo. Hey, it's the new girl. Am I right? Yeah, I'm the new girl. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. I don't need protection. Let's see what you got. I just need you to buy my crap. All right, here we go. What weapons? He has the big boy. For all, wow, for such a low cost of twelve grand. Yeah, okay. Old Faithful. Two grand. I'm gonna have to buy stuff. Hmm. Power armor frame. Could buy this stuff, but I don't really need it right now. Uh, could buy the. F oh my gosh, fusion cores are so expensive. Okay, um, I can sell the mines, and I can use that. I'm going to sell all the stuff I know I can sell first. Uh, I don't like the pipe stuff. I can sell that. I can sell that, that, and that. Short. Mm. Oops. Let me sell these. Now, let me sell all this stuff, because it's just a bunch of garbage. Chess piece. Yeah, this is just all a bunch of junk. Let me sell all this. Okay, now, what guns am I going to be using? The glow... The, I guess the glow-sided 10mm is probably the thing I want to use. So I need 10mm ammo. Give me that. Oh my gosh, that took like all my money. Okay. Guess that'll work for now. You saw this bird stuff. We don't need that. 
Um, could sell all of this to him. Let's do that. Not gonna sell the pre-war money yet. Gold watches, cigarette cartons, cigar box. I could sell ammo, but I'm not that dire in need yet. Come here, dog meat. I need to trade with you. Okay, let's get all these weapons. And now I have to make sure not to take what's equipped to him. It's just the welder goggles and the red bandana. Okay. Arturo. If you're thinking so a long range rifle lets you stay in cover and out of Okay, Arturo, I just need to sell you more garbage. I'm trying to think of what other ammo I should buy. Let me see how much money all this is worth. I don't need those 10 millis. High pistols. Need the pool keel. Pool keel. Pool cue. Let me sell all of this. Keep one dress. Newsboy cap. Gerator's garbage. Okay, so 400 bucks. Okay, hold on. Let me go. Let me go talk to. Let's go talk. Let me go talk to this girl. Excuse me. You? I don't know you. Just keep your distance. Keep calm. I'm standing still. That's exactly what a synth would say. I don't know. Are you really uh, human? Human as the day I was born. Well, you do look human enough. But I'll be watching you. I have eyes like a. Well, they're good eyes. Got it? All right. We can do business, but no funny stuff. I'll take a look. Sure. Odds and ends. Okay, what does she have? Anything? No weapons. Uh, she does have some med stuff. How many stim packs do I have? Hold on. Okay, I have 17 stim packs. I don't really need to buy any of those right now. How many Radaways? Five, that's alright. Hmm. I might buy this purified water. The one. I'm gonna buy. Do I, how many bobby pins do I have? I do have 20, but I'll buy them all because I don't want to run out and they're really cheap. Okay, let me get this 10 millimeter. I want to sell those. I think I'm just gonna hold on to that pre-war money for now because it doesn't cost. It, it's not any. Doesn't have any weight. Okay, let me sell all this stuff. We'll keep one green dress. Sell all of this. Keep that. Okay, we are making 138 bucks right now. Um, I could sell this buff out. I don't. Not gonna use the buff out. It's usually what I do with a lot of this food. Like this, it gives me rads. Not gonna eat it. Not gonna eat this. Not gonna eat... Well, I'm not gonna use Mentats. I'm gonna use that. Not gonna use that. See, a lot of the food you collect has rads within. It's just not worth it for me to eat it. Blanco mac and cheese. Let me sell. Oops. Okay. Okay, I think we're done. Let me take that buff out back. Give me that. Okay. Alright, so we have $753 now. I'm happy with that. Let's see here. Let me take this out. I could... Let me check what mods I can put onto this weapon real quick. Heavy frame receiver. What increases the damage the most? The hardened receiver? No, powerful. Oh, and I don't. I can't do that yet. I should probably hold on. This is gonna be a waste of time. But I'm gonna go back to. I wanna go. 
Let's go to the Red Rocket truck stop and see if I can... I know there's a weapons workbench back at Sanctuary, but there's also a weapons bench here. So it kind of depends on which one. I, I want to I mod this pistol because it's going to be the pistol I'm going to use here for a little while uh, until I... I forget when I get... There's a pistol I really like that's a 9mm that I get, but I don't remember when I get that. So I'm going to... I'm going to power, I'm going to make this gun as good as I can, um, and then when I get a better gun, I'll, you know, obviously switch it up, but I just bought a bunch of ammo for it, so it'd probably be intelligent, too. I don't think there's a weapon workbench here, so I'm going to have to build one. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Okay, so, the best one I can do is the hardened receiver. It takes all my screws, that's bad. Yep, because now I need screws. Yep, I need screws. What the heck gives me screws? What is going to give me screws? I might have to... I think they sell screws in Diamond City. But I could be wrong. None of this stuff is going to give me screws. It's just going to give me steels. Steals, it's just going to give me steel. Steel, it's just going to give me steel. Um, okay, yeah, I'm going to have to... We might have to come back to this. I'm not trying to rush this series, but obviously I don't want to sit here and just waste your guys' time with me jacking around. Oh, but that doesn't come with any... Doesn't come with what I need! Let me get rid of that tire that's glitched through the wall. Okay, I guess we'll make a we'll make a quick run back to Sanctuary, check what they have. If they don't have any, we'll go back to Diamond City and I'll do my quest inside of Diamond City because there's no fighting, and then we will uh we'll buy some screws because I'm pretty sure you can buy screws in Diamond City. If you can't, then I'm SOL and I'm just gonna move on. But hopefully there is some stuff that allows me to. Uh, uh, something with screws. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Because I want to make this pistol, like I said, as best as I can. Um, that's kind of the goal, I think. Is there not... There's not a weapon bench here. Because that's... That's... Well, no, I guess there is. I'm just stupid. Yeah, see... Okay, we do have screws here. We have a limited amount of screws, but we do have screws here me so oh crap it's indifferent stuff let me see here how much weight is this take all okay, carrying too much weight but I'm not gonna be building here really actually I probably am because I want to do the Minutemen quest stuff I need to set up I need to set up a trade route here so I don't have to worry about this Okay, so let me put some of this stuff back. I think the concrete... Yeah, the concrete weighs a ton. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's put the concrete back. Alright, now I'm going to... We're going to move on here. We're going to go back to Diamond City and do these quests inside of Diamond City. And then I'll... I'm going to check for screws. If I find screws, that's great. And then we'll move on to... Uh, we'll do some of uh, the quests within Diamond City, like talking to Nick Valentine and talking to Piper. Because I know those require no fighting, uh, so I'll be I'll be all good to go. And the only reason I think I'm going to take Piper over Dogmeat is because Piper has a gun. Dogmeat dog meat kind of runs out there and he kind of gets in your way sometimes, so I'm probably going to roll with Piper. But I'm not entirely sure yet. Why is this loading screen so long? <laughs> this loading screen. Don't move, Simp. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a Simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family. Put the gun down now. He's a Simp. He'll kill us all. Kyle, no. Okay, show's over. There are no Simps in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Well, 
He's dead. He doesn't need that stuff anymore. All right, it's mine. Okay, so it's night. Let me go talk to Nick Valentine. And then hopefully by the end... You gotta wonder, does anyone fight back? Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean so the real thirsty. All right, Valentine Detective Agency. Try to get Nick Valentine to help us find our son. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Okay, first of all... Want to come back here? The bills. Huh. Forget the bills. Okay, there's some stuff that's not even worth stealing. <laughs> I never did photograph well. That's worth stealing. Mongrel dog meat. Yeah, that's a Detective bunch of garbage. I'll never find another job. Okay, I think we're good. There is some stuff to steal. Let's see here, she has her back turned. I want to steal while I have dog meat, because dog meat doesn't care if I steal. Piper does. Okay, I'm hidden. Let me steal the dress. The wrench might have screws. Let me take that. Fuse. There's nothing to... That's nothing worse steal. Okay, let's talk to her. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... has gone missing. Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Hey, I'd love to help, but there's the small matter of expenses. Money, huh? I do have 125 caps in the old rainy day fund. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat get up. Please hurry. Okay, I'll take 125 bucks. I don't think I. My charisma may have been higher to get more, but 125 is pretty good. Okay, let me see here. Okay, I'm hidden. Okay, there we go. Anything else to steal? Ooh, two more ca Okay, nothing. Alright, let's go. Let's go talk to Piper. Should probably use a rat away and heal up. Because I'm a little bit low on health. If I'm going to go fight and get Nick Valentine back, so... Go ahead and let's go ahead and use a rat away, and then let me get some more rat chunks. We'll level up here in a minute. I don't need to level up yet um, because I'm gonna level up again probably. So I'll just do them all my level ups then. Okay, so that's some decent intel. Okay, so let's go see Piper. Let me see if there's anything here to steal. Okay, there's nothing there to steal. Alright, public occurrences. Okay, where is Piper? I think there's some stuff to steal. Got nothing better to do? No, I really don't. I thought there was some something good to steal. Glad you dropped by. You holding up, Lou? Okay, never mind. What I thought I could steal. Why are you calling me that? Cause you're a vault dweller. 
I know you're not wearing a blue jumpsuit right now, but the Pip Boy and that fish out of water look. Dead giveaways. So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait, what? <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The woman out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Can you even compare the two? The world out here? It's not even close to the one I left. Feeling a little homesick, are we? Can't say I blame you. No. A big question. You came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? I lost family, okay? I'm trying to get one of them back. What's their name, Blue? Who are they? My baby, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? The Institute? Who are they? That, Blue, is the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth. No one really knows who or where they are, but their handiwork is all over. Synths. Synthetic people. Sent from their hidden labs to do the Institute's dirty work. Sometimes they even replace a person with a synth double. A little covert agent no one would ever suspect. Now, not everything that goes wrong has the Institute behind it, but there's always a chance. That's why I'm asking. I don't know. No one ever does. That's what makes them so scary. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? No matter how much you want to give up, don't. You have to have hope that, that you'll see them again, or at least that you'll know the truth. A strong note to end on, Blue. Thanks. That's everything. It's going to take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to get Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where this story goes next. Hey, Piper. Head my way? Sure, let's go. Will do. Oh, sorry, boy. Time for you to head home. Okay, I'm gonna send him to the truck stop because that's gonna be where I uh, I build my house. Okay, so now we have Piper. Who am I detected by? Oh, the stupid, your stoop. Get your sister out of here. Go away, Nat. Go away. Keep going. Why is she gotta be? Oh no, I can just take it now. Yes. I could just steal. Okay, I don't need any of that. Well, I'll take the desk fan because I know now. Anything I can do? You just say the word. Combination wrench. All right, now that I can get back here and steal stuff, is there anything here? No. Nope. 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 
this is literally just a bunch of junk, but I will take it. Yeah, ladle. Okay, now let's go back out here and see if anybody is selling screws, and then we'll call it an episode. And then we'll probably go save Nick Valentine. Actually, there's probably... Telling you how to pick your friends. Piper's time to trouble. You know what you're looking for? We have everything. Okay, let me wait until the day. And then we will uh, check for screws, and then I'll call it an episode. And then we'll either start next episode with something new, or we will start it with me modding my weapon. I don't think Drug Guy has anything. So we're just gonna start over here. This guy has wood, I believe. Here to pick up a swatter. Right? I'll take a look. Sure. A swatter never runs out of bullets. Okay. Yeah, he has cork and wood. That doesn't help me. What do you have, Arturo? Shotgun's great insurance against raiders, but I got a lot of options here. I'll take a look. Sure. Self-defense at its best. Okay. Do you have screws? Yes! 980 bucks! Oh my gosh! Does any of this stuff come with screws? Oh, this is horrible. No. I hate... I hate these shipments. Why are they so expensive? I wonder if the money glitches don't work. Sure. I highly doubt it. Do you have anything junk-wise that has screws? Okay, antique globes. Okay. Anything else with screws? I'll take this camera. Desk fan. Uh, I'll take this fuse. Screw in a hand in the handcuffs. Copper saran. Okay, that's kind of expensive. Though. I don't need that right now. Hot plate has a screw. Adhesive. That is important, but I'm not spending that type of money right now. Telephones. There are some stuff that I just want to buy when I, like when I'm searching here. Ceramic is pretty hard. Aluminum. And they're not hard to get. You just have to find them. They don't. They're they're not as easy to get. Um, they're in like wood or steel or whatnot, and they're stuff that you use for a lot of stuff. Alrighty guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode. In the next one, we will be modding our weapon. Uh, I might move a couple of things around at the Red Rocket truck stop just, just because. And so I will uh, catch you guys then. Peace out.